Yo, yo, what up? Yo, yo, what up? Welcome to another vlog. Vlogging every day, every day. Every single day. We be vlogging up in here. Yo, yo, starting off my day right. Starting off my day right. We had extreme time to get to work. Let's see what we got in my dad's truck. Pretty sure we got drinks. Yep. How many cases? We got five cases of Pyrade and one huge case of monsters. I think this is like a 24 pack. Yeah, 24. Freaking crazy. There she is. I need to, um, God, there's no more Pyrades. We're, we're gonna be stocked. I mean, we're gonna be out there 12 days, so I might, might even need some more once my mom comes up. But I gotta cut this oxygenator out real quick so we can go get it refilled. I'm scared of these irritating things. Makes me think they're gonna blow up on them. <laughs> Alright, we got it. We got the, we got the bomb. Yo, yeah, that's pretty dang wicked. Got the monsters, got the power eats. And then cases of water, we I believe we still have some. We can go pick some up. Yeah, we got some over here. Just got the graphs put on. I'm about to throw some waypoints in for Kentucky that we have from last year. And take all the like the Pickwick stuff off. Cause we don't want to keep it all like crammed in there. There's um Pickwick right there. We got a lot of our waypoints on from world finals. So we're gonna take these off and um throw Kentucky in. Going to go eat and then we're gonna go to Oakwood. We're just eating at a restaurant that's by Oakwood. We just got all the stuff put in the graphs. Um Kentucky Lake stuff. We thought we lost it, but he had a backup on a different card. So we imported all that stuff, took all Pickwick's crap off so it doesn't slow it down. Here are the food place. I'm gonna grab a bite to eat. Round number two. At Oakwood, gotta get the oxygen. That's my hat. Gotta get the oxygen and stuff. Fill it up. Swag. So, man, how you doing? You good? Good video. <laughs> it's similar to the swamp, the little swamp crawlers. Oh, it is a swamp crawler, it's just a different version. Why do you keep to grab it? You know, you're a work, 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 Oh yeah, white trash. White trash. I'm white trash. My parents are related. I'm white trash. My trailer is outdated. I'm white trash. Earnhardt was the best, and I paid for my family with welfare checks. The twerk. The twerk. Y'all like that color. The twerk. The twerk. Black red. Sweet. Here's white trash. Here's tramp stamp. <laughs> Look, you gotta see if you don't know if the camera will pick this up. Look the flirt. For everybody Signal out there that wants to know why they call this a twerk, see if you can get that. That's actually a butt with a thong bikini in it. Boy, I'm a lie. Boy, I'm a lie. 
Booty on me like, like what? You got a bag? Really? Or nah, booty dropping down low? That's crazy. That thong to thong, thong, thong. Oh my god. Let's do some twerking. Twerk, 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 twerk. This is the Ben Parker swim bait. I would eat. Yeah, here we go. Can I go to the bathroom? Get That's all I use. The steam all. There's some just jig heads. That's all I use, though. Got a big selection. There's fish heads. Fish heads. That's all I use. There's a dude. A fish head. It says fish head spin or um, swarm and hornet lures, but they actually changed their name to just fish head. Do they have any in this fish? That's, not, yeah. <laughs> That's what you want. Yeah, I was yeah. gonna put. I was gonna put some big kind of crawl on it and do this. Burn it. Yeah, try it. For all the gay boys up. Totally kidding. <laughs> Rainbow. You can see the two ounce. And stop it. Stop it. And stop it. And I'm like, wait. Hold up. Please let me roll up. Hey, yo. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> wait, do that one more time. <laughs> you put that behind it. So I bought a nice car for that kind of money. Yeah. <laughs> I drove mine away from Traded in the Jeep, got himself a truck so he could start pulling the boat and all that and get ready for college. I'm going napping in the back, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else? Is what? Just get out of Oakwood. About to go back to Extreme, get everything ready, get everything tied up for the trip. Just got here. Got the oxygen tank. All filled up, ready for Kentucky. Um, got the got some baits. Got some secret stuff. Not really. Some stuff from the other day, but like today. Got a couple hair jigs. Got a got a new pair of scissors. Chartreuse pin. Got some drop shot worms and new zoom ones. Yeah, that's about it. What we just got. So pretty much. We're gonna we're gonna kind of most of the baits that like we have in the boat from World Finals, um, Pickwick, they're gonna be most most of them we're gonna be using at Kentucky. So we don't have to clean out too much, but we're gonna clean out the boat, make sure we have everything situated, make sure we have everything that we're gonna be needing for Kentucky. Um, we're pretty much gonna take the rods out, throw the rod gloves on, maybe um, set up a new rod and reel combo for some other bait that I'm gonna be throwing. Um, just get everything kind of situated. The boat's all cleaned up and everything right now, so uh, not too much more to do. And then we're off. We're off to Kentucky for like 12 days. So it's gonna be a pain in the butt. We also gotta put the oxygenator. We gotta strap that thing down in with the zip ties. Where are the zip ties at? Gotta strap that down. That's how freaking big of a mess it is, are you? Pickwick, it's crazy. Threw some in here and got everything tied on over here. A lot of stuff that we used at Pickwick, some of the same general stuff. Just got the poles already, all good. Lined up with the rod gloves on. Got a lot of stuff. During the tournament, we'll probably end up not having that many rods. We'll probably keep some in the room, but about to throw some drinks in the cooler now. You got baits. We got baits. Just got everything all situated. We had such a mess a second ago. Well, we got it all handled. We got it all organized. Took everything out. Um, put new stuff back in. So we're all good. Um, we're ready to rock and roll. Should be good. Um, hey guys, I know you watch Noah all the time, but what you don't see is behind the scenes of three hours sitting in the boat organizing tackle retying all of his rods, making sure his line's right. You know, he's got a half a day into just getting the boat ready to leave town. So you guys need to think about being organized when you go out to fish. Yeah, that's a really big key, just being prepared. You need to be prepared. Like you saw, we put the waypoints in and everything. I mean, you guys don't understand. I know you're watching this video as in two minutes worth of time, but I mean, we've been sitting here for hours. I mean, it's 
it's actually 407 i actually forgot to post tackle tuesday on instagram post that at three but i mean we're sweating our butt i mean it's literally 80 it's probably 95 degrees back here because we have no air back here had that little fan but it does not help so it's ridiculous just got some of the stuff in here that we're gonna need it is so hot back here guys here's some other tackle but this is gonna go in the back of the truck just to be prepared to make sure we have everything we need. So the boats are ready, everything's inside, poles are ready, everything's good to go. So it's all cleaned up. Should be ready to leave tomorrow. God, I'm exhausted, people. It's really much tougher than you think. All this tournament crap. When you're when you're traveling like this, man, it wear you out. I mean I'm sweating like right now like crazy. More of because the office is just pure hotness back there. If I had to guess, it's around 100 degrees, like straight up, maybe even hotter. It's bad back there. It's way worse than it is outside. Way worse. I'm just glad we got that over with, you know? I didn't get too much footage, and I'm sorry about that. I kind of wanted to get a little bit more footage, you know? I wanted to get get more of the prep, but my mom was kind of doing something. I need to like, <laughs> I need to hire me a cameraman. He wants to be my cameraman. Come down, you're gonna be the kick in the ass TV cameraman. I'm gonna stop by the gas station real quick, grab a drink, go home. I should have a pretty sick package waiting on me at home. And um, I'm gonna show you guys, you're gonna get a live unboxing, it's gonna be pretty sick. I'm excited, uh, I contacted them, I'm not gonna name out the um, company yet, but contacted them two days ago, all right? Two days ago, I was like, I need this stuff, going off the nationals, I need this stuff for my tournament. And they were like, all right, man, I'll get it out to you. Sent, I mean, that see guys that's the people that you need in your life that's the people that you need on your team man you need people that are going to be there for you and if they're if they ever need any help for me i'm going to be there for them you know that's the type of relationship you need with companies type of relationship you need with friends and family as well guys because uh, i can guarantee you i know a lot of people that are fishing this national tournament um that fished it the last year that i that i got to meet i met those people at nationals last year and that's the thing about traveling and stuff, guys. You, you meet so many new people, and it, it's awesome. I mean, I, I love meeting new people. And, and that's that's fans, not only fans, but that's friends that are going to be there for you. And they're going to back you up whenever stuff goes down. Say somebody's um, talking bad about you. Say some, God, what is this person doing? Say somebody's talking bad about you over social media. They're there to back you up, you know. I mean, and you can't beat that. Friends and family fans especially you guys man like you guys support me so much it's ridiculous and i try to knock out these videos for you as you guys can see i'm sweating my butt off man I'm, I'm working hard for you guys not only for me for the tournament but i'm working hard on these videos if you guys know i mean we were we were off the world finals now we're going off the nationals man and that that's tough for me to post all those videos i have them scheduled i had to work my butt off to get those scheduled i still have tons of videos scheduled for you guys to watch but I, I'm not going to stop, man. I'm not going to let up. If I don't get sleep, I don't get sleep. I, I'm making these videos for you guys. I'm a man of my word. If I'm going to post Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday, that means I'm going to post Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday. I'm going to get it done, you know. It's more important than sleep. Hitting up the gas station real quick. I'm actually going to grab me another monster. Um, I'm going to the gym later, so I'm going to need a little boost, man. Especially after all that freaking... I'm just whooped, so... No excuses, guys. No excuses. How do, man? Dude's looking at me like, what does he do? How you doing? That's it. Have a good day. I honestly think I scared that dude a little bit, you know. <laughs> he was talking like real soft. He's like, he's like, it's 2:45, and it ended up being 2:46. Bro, why are you lying to me? He was all nervous. He was like a deer in headlights. Why a monster going down there? I'm opening it right here. You know, people ask me. 
Like, is it weird when you're like talking in front of people and people are watching you talk to a camera? Like, those people are hearing me over there. I can do it for the fans, man. No excuses. It ain't weird. People gotta recognize. Wild monster, baby. Yeah, surviving off these. Yo, you know, like, like when we um were out of town, we're out of town at Pickwick. I was literally drinking like two, to, two at least two a day. It was like at least two. Sometimes three. Like I was surviving off these things. Not just a main source of energy and like drink, but main source of like food, dude. Like when you drink, I lost too much. I've, I've been losing too much weight. Like I used to be way bigger, like just bigger, like muscular than I am now, but like just tournaments and everything, just like I lost like 20 pounds. I was like, I don't know, I lost a lot of weight. But yeah, I was surviving off of these things, man. It's ridiculous. They fill your stomach because of the carbonation and stuff. So yeah, who listens to Kevin? They talk and they talk, but I do not hear shit when I'm I swear to God that I came up. Yo, Bass Boat, shout out. He's representing. Except he's got a mirror on the back, too. Alright, alright. We're home. Enough with the games. Hopefully there's a package. Is this in the mailbox? I hope there's a package because I'm like really psyched for it. If not, then it must be getting here later. Yo, 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 that's not cool. Yo, this bug like lives here. It's been here for like three weeks. I, like, lived a lot. Of, like, last time it was like right here. And I saw it up there. It's like, it lives here. Yo, we getting bombed. You hear it? Yo. Yo, 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 yo. Yo. If anyone just saw that, they were probably like, what's going on? Man. Man. This mail. Well, it's coming here today. I know it is. I'm a sidekick. I know it's coming. It's coming. It's coming. My neighbor's probably thinking I'm like a freak. I don't know. I have a YouTube channel. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Feels so freaking good in here. It's ridiculous how good it feels. Oh, got my Alliance jersey, right? For Nationals? Here's some hooray. But... Oh, here's my fortune cookies, too. Yo. Who broke my fortune cookie. It's all good. Got my Alliance jersey, though. Has my name on it and everything, right? What's up, doggy? What you doing? I didn't get mine last year because... Because... I'm not going to tell you why, but... All right. And my name and everything. You know, everything looks pretty good. Representing Georgia, you know? You know what I'm saying? So flip it on to the back. So... Where my sponsor logo is supposed to be. All right, so we got we got Rigid, we got St. Croix, we got Berkeley, we got Under Armour. Um, yep. What are they doing? Ugh. I don't know why. I don't know why that was like. What are they doing? Mm. And then they have that, and they have that, and they have that. And that's all right. That's all right. They have those three. Like, what's going on? Like, come on. Sorry, it's all right. All right, doggy. Sorry, it's all right. Sorry. You know what I just realized, man? Look at me. I mean, look. Representing, man. Got all this, all this kicking their bass stuff. Looking good. Going to work out. Freaking package hasn't came yet, and that kind of considers that. That worries me concerns me because it was supposed to come you know i don't know if it'll come this late but hopefully it does you know because i was really wanting to show you but if it doesn't if it's not here by the time i get back from my workout i'll just uh, i'll go ahead and tell you i'm not gonna hide something from you i just kind of want to surprise you with it it's pretty sick i think it's gonna be pretty sick all right guys so i'm gonna go hit the gym it's probably gonna be the last clip i'll catch you guys after the gym hey what's going on guys just got out of the gym and honestly, oh man, I thought that was gonna be a horrible workout. 
Well, all I, all I can say is, man, that was a good workout. I, I really, I really thought it wasn't gonna be good, but dude, I, I killed it, and it was packed. I've never seen it that packed in there. I got to do what I wanted to do, which was good. Which I'm not really on a training split right now because I've been fishing so much that like, God, I gotta turn some AC on. I've been fishing so much that I haven't been able to work out. Like I haven't worked out in like months. Right there, I just put on my old Eminem recovery album. Man, just went to work. Eminem always pumps me up during workouts. I don't know why. Comment down, like, if you guys work out, what, what's your, what pumps you up, man? Like, there's some songs that just pump me up, or some artists, you know what I mean? Eminem's one of them. Like, when I work out, Eminem, it's pretty good. Just got to the house, and this dude's massaging my dad's back, all right? And just wait till you see his license plate. I literally died the first time I saw it. But the dude's license plate says hog doctor dude. He's massaging my dad's back. That's kind of freaking weird if you ask me. I'm just saying. Look at all these games. I'm about to get sweet potatoes and chicken. Looks so good. You want some? You want some? I'm just kidding, man. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Whoa. Made it all foggy. Let's keep it real right now. This is I'm watching Impractical Jokers. It's like the funniest show on TV. It's such a good show. Look at this beggar. Yo, yo, yo. No. <laughs> Got you in the vlog, go. No. Sign out the video, guys. Why are you holding me back? I can't move. I Signing out the video. Um, I know I told you that I was gonna be um doing the like curving and stuff, but that didn't happen. It's actually storming like super bad, so I'm just gonna go tomorrow. I'm probably gonna wake up like at five, hit the gym, and um, I'm gonna vlog everything. So I don't know if I'll vlog that early, but I'm gonna vlog tomorrow. So or next vlog you guys are gonna see. Got a lot of videos scheduled, so everything's good. While I'm out of town, I'll be doing some live Q and A's, um, like that one right there. So it'll be pretty sick, guys. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know below. See you guys next time.